Hey, what's up guys? It's Ohei from GinaAndGrowStrong.com, the best-selling author and former chubby hubby. So to all you chubby hubbies and wifeys out there, I got a new tutorial. Let's get started. We're going to today talk about uh, the pandeiro. Now there's two different ways that I'm going to teach you. I'm going to teach you an easy way, which is the American step-by-step -step way, and then the, the original Brazilian way or cadencia. Now one thing you have to consider is, remember where the Brazilians, the ones that were raised in Brazil, are raised with music, drumming in the streets, carnival, bossa nova music all the time. So they were inherently bred and raised, you know, with the, with this music. And it's it's not like contemporary music. It's it's very uh, smooth and it's very rhythmic. Um, so when it's a little bit hard to 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 learn like them right away. So the first way that I'm going to teach you is this easy step by step way. So first of all, as you know, uh, hold. Hold the bandero, fingers underneath, thumb on top, okay? And then we're going to count like this. We're going to, with our thumb, we're going to hit on the edge, not on the side, but on the edge, okay, with our thumb, three times. One, two, three. The fourth one in the pattern, open hand slap in the middle, okay? So the pattern is one, two, three. And so, if we hear the beating bout going, playing Salbento Grande de Angola, that's how we follow it. Moving on, we're going to add the second step to that to give you a little flourish. We're going to give a tuck at that. There's two different ways you could give the tuck at that, or a triplet. So, the first way is this. Hit, down, up. Okay. One, two, three. Or there's a way you could go up. Three noises, a triplet. I did this for years. And I just realized it's a it's a big wrist move. So this was a little bit more uh, easier on the wrist. So we add that tuck at that on beat one. Tuck at that. Two, three, slap. One, two, three, slap. Tuck it, slap. Two, three, slap. Tuck it, slap. Two, three, slap. Tuck it. All right. So that's the easy one, two, three way. Now here's the original way. It looks like it's easier at first. We're gonna go right with the clapping. Say we hear uh, the hoda, the people clapping. Clap, 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 clap. So we're gonna follow that like this. Clap, clap. Out, in slap, back on the edge for an open tone. Okay, so where's the tug at the part? Here's where it gets a little bit fancy, the samba roll. So first we're going to teach it like this. Make sure that you have your hand even here. You get a heel and the front, your forefingers on the edge here, making the same noise. Okay, once you've got that, the hang of that, we're going to add in the thumb. So, taka, taka. Now it's four. One, two, three, four. Taka, taka. And then if you want to later on, when you, when you get a little bit better, you could do the samba roll. For now, let's just do one each pattern. So we add that on the one. So that's uh, the tutorial for the pandero, two easy ways, or one easy way and one regular way, the cadencia for, to play against uh, pretty much any rhythm. 
uh, look for more videos. And also, if you're looking for a, to, an easy get started course, make sure you look in the description. I have my free home training course. So look for that and click on that. Also, keep the comments coming. Keep the, let me know what else you want to, you want to hear. All right. So remember, share, like, subscribe, and follow. Jinga and grow strong.